The master and boys of the fourth form are still at the zoo. We left them last time in rather sorry straits. Bottomley, after causing no end of trouble, had fallen into the bear pit, and Dr. Pym had fainted. We'll cross right back to the zoo and see what's happening now. Yeah, stand back there. Stand back. All right, boy, keep cool. Keep cool. Can I just jump again the bear pit? I hope he's not hurt. Get back there, you kids, or you'll go down too. Get back there, Bruno. Here, lad, grab this. Now hold up. Up you come. Up, up. Get back there, Bruno. Here, give us a pull. Come on, up. Oh, I'm sweet. Strike. Gee, it was decent down there. And just what do you think you were doing down there, me lad? Well, you don't think I went down there to have lunch, do you? Now, look here, me boy. I'm not answering no riddles. You got no right down in the bear pit. Well, I fell down. Yes, and you're very lucky you ever come up again. Yes, that's a carnivorous animal. What is? The leopard. That ain't no leopard. That's a bear. Yes, but if it had been a leopard, it'd be carnivorous. What would? The bear. I... Listen, I don't know what you're talking about. Yes. Well, that's what my teacher told me. Oh, and well, who's your teacher? That fella over there under the tree. What, him? Yes. He looks dead. What's the matter with him? He fainted, Mr. Yes, he threw a shepherd. Fainted? Yeah, do him good. Yes. Well, hadn't you better do something? Yes, but he's fainted before. Yeah, he's always fainting. Leave him there. Listen, is he your teacher, too? Oh, mine? Yes. Yeah, worse luck. Why? Well, I'd like to have a word with him. He should be responsible for you while you're in this here zoo. Yeah, and that's what I thought. Not go allowing you to fall into no bear pits. Yeah, that's what I reckon when he pushed me. When he pushed you? Yeah, he pushed me into the bear pit. Oh, he never did, bottom. Ah, shut up, Stan. Of course he did. Yes. Yes, why? Yes, he did it. Now, look here, me lad. Did he push you in the bear pit or didn't he? Sure he did. Oh, get it. Well, follow me. We'll see this. Yes, Come on, you go. Here, you wake up. Still yeah, go and get some water. Strike, you know, he shouldn't have pushed me. Yeah, well, that's the same as being carnivorous. What is? You know, if that bear had been a leopard. Listen, are you mad? Yes. I thought so. Yes, but I'm not carnivorous. I wouldn't be surprised at what you were. Yes, well, I've never eaten myself. That's a pity. Yes. Here's some water. Here, give it to me and I'll bathe his ears. Yes. I'll be sweet in a minute. Now, how does that feel? He's done this before. Yeah, he's always doing it. Yes. Oh, look, his eyes are opening. He's all right. How do you feel? He'll be all right in a minute. Where am I? You're in the zoo. He's in the rats. Oh, where's Bottomley? He's, look, he's in the bear pit. No, he's not. Yes, he's not. I got him out. Here I am. Oh, oh, you're safe. Thank heaven. Now, just what do you mean by pushing him in? I... I beg your pardon? This here boy has made an accusation that you pushed him in the bear pit. Yes. Sure. Did I push him in? Yes, that's what he says. Oh, does he? Well, I didn't. Well, I thought you did. Well, did, did you? Did I? Listen, I... I well, I, I mean, I can't say for sure now. No, I, I shouldn't think you could. But I was pushed in all right, and I mean, you were the only one near me. What? Well, that's the same thing, ain't it? it, it it's the wrong thing. That I did nothing of the kind. Yes. Uh, yes, what? Yes, that's being carnivorous. Of course it is. What? Look, hold your tongue, Greenbottle. You, you don't know what you're talking about. Why don't you look after these boys? You're their master. I know I am. But but, but this boy, Bottomley, had been exceptionally rude. So he but, pushed me in the bear pit. Bottomley, I did no such thing. Yes, I was there with him. Well, you are. He's a witness. Yes. Look, did you see him push him in the pit? Uh, yes. Greenbottle. Yes, I was there. You were where? I was alongside you. Yes, and where was I? You were talking to the carnivorous animal. Now, you... Oh, you, you you mean the leopard? Yes. What? Well, well, there you are, Keeper. I was in front of the leopard's cage when this boy fell into the into the pit 50 yards away. So it's not at all likely that I pushed him. Ah, oh, you messed it up, Green Bottle. Well, yes. Uh, well, if you ask me, I... you're all mad. Yes. Hold your tongue, Green Bottle. You're the one that gives us all a bad reputation. Yes. And as for you, Master Bottomley... Oh, I never did anything. Never did anything? No. No. All you did was misbehave yourself, and, and when I tell you to go home, you fall into this bear pit and then to cap it all, you accuse me of pushing you. Well, if you ask me, I think it'd be a good idea if you all went and jumped into the bear pit. Oh, do you? Well, nobody asked you. Getting fresh, are you? Yes. N no. Don't no. him, sir. Yes. Don't him. Have Don't a go Keep quiet. Listen, do you want to fight? I've no desire to fight at all. I wouldn't let him speak to me like that. Oh, you wouldn't, well, listen, wouldn't you? Yeah, and it's someone your own side. Yes, how dare you threaten that boy? Oh, well, I'll have a go at you. Now, listen, Barney. 
him over, sir. Have a go at him. Don't him in, Mr. Shad. I'll do all the dying you want. Mr. Shad, you're frightened. Go back and play with your white mice. I'll give you Bobby, white look, mice. You want to play with your white mice? Don't have a go at him. I'm about fed up. I wish you boys would mind your own business. Take that. No. Oh, 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 You were a great help, Bottomley. Well, I thought I was. Oh, did you? And and what did you say to the head keeper of the zoo? What did I say? Yes, yeah, what did you say? You told him to go away and play with his white mice. Yes, sir. I've never seen such disgraceful behaviour in the whole of my life. It, 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 it's been nothing but mischief, rudeness, arguments and fights as we got here. Well, what else do you want to fill in the day? Well, I... Botany. What did you say? Thanks, sir. Yes, you were being rude again. Oh, me, sir. Yes, and uh, what did you say then? Oh, I just said, oh, I probably had too much to say. Oh, did you? Yes, well, well, for once you're quite right. Yes. Yes, what? Yes, he's going to play with his white mice. Now, has he? Yes, and, and do you know where you're going? All of you? You're going home. And the next time I bring you to the zoo, we'll, we'll go to the museum. Yes. Keep quiet. Please, sir, where are the white mice? Stand up. Look, and I've had about enough of you as well. Mind your own business. And if anybody mentions white mice again, I'll... Uh, I will push them in the bear pit. Yes. Yes, what? Yes, but that's being carnivorous. Yes, great but look, I wish you'd go and feed yourself to the lions. Yes. The, the only trouble is it, it, it wouldn't be fair to the lions. Yes. Yes, well, you'd better behave yourself or I, I, I will throw you in with the lions. There's just a chance that they might swallow their pride and attack you. Yes, they can swallow what they like, but not me. Yeah, well, be careful. Let's come and see the monkey, sir. We're not going to see anything more at all. Oh, oh sure. you go, I've sure seen all I wish to see in the zoo, thank you, and I've no intention of looking at the monkeys. I thought they were your mates. Yes, but I did What did you say, Bottomley? Sorry, sir. Yes, what oh. did you say, then? Why, I just said, uh, oh, do we go out through the gates? Oh, did you? Well, yes, we do. How else do you think we're going to get out? In an underground tunnel or something? I was just wondering. Well, listen, you boys follow me, and I don't want any nonsense. I'm going to take you home. Yes, but I want to see the elephants. So do Well, I. you're not going to. You're going straight home. I've got my car out here, and I'll, I'll run you all back as far as the school. Oh, have you got your car, sir? Yes, I have, possibly. But you don't deserve a ride. You ought to be made to walk. However, come on, look, look. let's get out of here before we get into any more trouble. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get out of well, now, here's the car. Here. Come on, get it. Oh, sure. Drive. Can I drive it, sir? What? Can I drive? If you do, I'll walk. The same here. Green Greenbottle, look. If I was completely paralysed and I had to go through town, I'd still walk rather than ride with you driving. Yeah. Can I right. sit in the front, sir? I don't care where you sit. Now, get in. Go on. Yeah, well, I want to sit in the front. Go on, oh. I ask first. Yes, well, it doesn't matter who I... Yes, well, why don't you walk? Shut up, Mr. Will. Will, will you boys stop, getting... stop this arguing? Yes, but I'll get... Sick if I don't sit in the front. All right, well, sit in the front. I, oh, I... Strong. Look, if there's going to be much more of this arguing, you'll all walk. Yes. Well, it seems settled, Greenbottle, that you sit up in the front. Yes. You mean I can drive? Yes, of course. What? Drive? Greenbottle, look, you couldn't drive a nail. Yes, I could. I'm a wretched mile of You shut up, you bloody... Well, will, will you, boys, uh, listen, will you stop behaving drive. like a lot of larrikins? Uh. Greenbottle, you're not going to drive. Is that clear? You're not capable of driving. Yes, I am capable. Well, I say you're not. Yes, well, I drive for me old man. Oh, do you? Well, yes. Uh, I, I didn't know your father had a car. Yes. Yes, what? Yes, he hasn't. Well, what are you talking about? Yes, but I drive his scooter. His scooter? Yes. Oh, do you? Well, you're not driving my car. Now, get get up in the front there. Yes. Go on, get, get in, Green Bottle. Look, and you, you other boys get, get in the right? back and mind that paint. I oh, say, I'd rather go in the front. Now, 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 is everybody, is everybody set? Yeah, yeah, well, I've had a good 
have to be very careful on these slippery roads. Yes, be nice, dear Richard. Now, get out of it. Get out of it, Green Bottle. You'll have us into the fence in a minute. I'll, I'll, ring up. I'll do nothing of the sort, Bottomley. Go on, sir. Be a support. But I'm driving this car, thank you. Pull out the frock, Granny. Yes. Mind your own business, Robert. What, what are you doing there, Green Bottle, you idiot? Yeah. 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 We're skinny. Yeah. 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 Once again, Dr. Pym's pupils have caused him trouble. But this time, it really seems to be serious. Be sure you hear the next episode of The Craziest School on the Air.